Hey everybody, I'm Sosastic and welcome back on Get to Know Your Lions, episode about Colmec. I hope you will enjoy, so let's go. Name Colmec Skyla, meaning free spirit, highly attractive. Spaces lion, gender male, rain flex rain. Kolmek was born in the African lands, far away from pride lands. His father is an unknown lion and his mother was a rogue lioness who died while hunting when Kolmek was still young. The little cub wandered around the African lands for days before a young human girl found him near a little water stream. Her name was Zawadi, and she was from a tribe called the Red Sand. Seeing the lion cub, the little girl picked him up and took him to her village. But when the people saw her coming with a lion, they warned the chief of the village who explained to Zawadi why she couldn't keep the cub. First, it was a lion. Secondly, Taking the baby away from her mother would of course attract her to the village, which would be a very bad idea. Stubborn, Zawadi didn't give up. For the next week, she kept going out from the village to feed the lion she named Skyla. After a moment, seeing the mother wasn't coming around to pick her baby, the chief of the Red Sand allowed the girl to keep her lion. From that day, Zawadi and Skylar became the best friend ever and grew up together. Also, the Red Sen never got in trouble with the other tribes due to the fact they were feared because they tamed a lion who could now defend them. But one day, as Skylar was now a teen lion, almost an adult, Atienu, the son of the chief, got aggressive towards Zawadi refused to become his girlfriend. Problem, Skylar was always around his best friend to protect her and seeing that guy assaulting her, the lion attacked the man who got injured. After that, the chief decided to ban Skylar from the tribe. Anyway, it was time for him to leave. He was a lion and had to leave as a lion in the savannah. He had to find a lioness and to get cubs. That's how things were explained to Zawadi, to make her understand she couldn't keep a wild animal as a pet anymore. Understanding, the girl agreed with a heavy heart to let go of a friend. Though, Kolmek stayed around the village for a few days, not really understanding why he got banned. One night. As he was hoping for Zawadi to come, Atieno and his friend decided to attack him. Zawadi arrived just in time to protect her best friend and got slapped by the man. Understanding that staying was putting her in danger, Skylar finally accepted to leave and it's where his lion life began. For the next year, the rogue lion traveled a lot through the African lands. Unable to hunt because he never learned. He managed to get fed by rogue lionesses by charming them, staying with them for a few days before leaving. He jumped from lioness to lioness, not really caring to be a player. One day, as he was approaching the Pride Lands, he met Rocco and Mist. Spending some time with them, he got close to Mist, which pissed the black lion off. This rivalry with Rocco was something that amused Kolmek, reason why he spent more time with them than he used to spend with the previous lionesses. But the moment he understood he was stepping in a war, Kolmek decided to drop his new friends. He couldn't fight. He grew up with human, and he didn't want to die. But he quickly regretted it. He liked these new friends, and maybe they could become a clan. Returning to them, Komek finally found a place to stay, at Pride Rock, 
as Flex Wright R. During his time spent around the king, Kolnick learned how to fight. Also, he met Safira, with whom he quickly fell in an unconditional love. Unfortunately, he got separated from the love of his life during the Second War of Pride Rock, war where he also lost an eye. Hiding in the jungle of the world, he became a part of the wilds, but always tried to find a way to save Safira. He didn't know the whole time that Safira was pregnant with him, and the day he got to find his female, he learned about Hekuba, his daughter. Unfortunately, he never got to meet his daughter, whom had disappeared. Indeed, he got murdered before Safira and him could find their cub. So, as you could understand, Kolmek is a non-official character. He was created for my Lion King series. He is present in the season 1, The Lion King Family Tree, and season 2, Golden Trio. I hope you enjoyed him. I know some of you liked Kolmek, because when he died, you have been a lot saying he was your favorite character, So let me know what you think of him now that you got to know him more with his past life. Um, you can also give me some suggestion on what lion you would like me to present in the next episode of Get to Know Your Lion. Reminder, if you suggest me a lion, please do not suggest a fan-made lion. You have to make sure the lion is either a lion present in the movies or in the comics. Because I do not wish and I do not want, I do not want to talk about a fan made lion. Except if they are mine. So you can also suggest a lion I created for my Lion King series. Other than that, I will not present the lion. So this was the new video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like on this video, share the video, help me to get my channel known by sharing the videos. And if you are not subscribed, because I know some of you watch my video without being subscribed, please mind subscribing and click on the notification bell to get all the notification from my channel. I'm gonna see you soon guys for another video, bye bye and take care.